This is the BabySeed's alarm system that we've developed for our 345 project. It works using two pressure pads, here and here. Uh, one will be placed on the parent seat and the other on the child seat. Uh, when the child has been placed in the seat, uh, the indication light on top of the device will turn blue. And once the adults on their seat, the device will turn green, indicating the device is ready to be used. If at any stage the parent leaves the car and the child is, is still being detected, uh, the three-tier warning system will start. The first stage is a gentle lullaby. Give the parent enough time to get the child out of the car before the alarm goes off. If this time elapses, the second tier of the alarm will start, which will be a siren with flashing lights. After this, if the ch child is still in the car, the third and final tier of the warning system will be activated, which will be a text message to the parent's phone. From here, the parent can respond to the text message and either deactivate the alarm or call the police. If at any stage the child is removed, the alarm will deactivate and will return to its basic state. And I'll demonstrate the device for you. As you can see, I've now placed one pressure pad under the baby seat and one pressure pad on my seat. As you put the baby down on their seat, the light will turn blue, indicating the presence of the child. If you pick it up at any stage, the device will deactivate, returning back to its original state. As I sit down on my pressure pad, the light will change from blue to green, indicating the device is ready to be used. Once the light is green, the device is now active. If I get off the seat, the first tier will start with the lullaby, followed by the siren, and then the text message. As you can see, this is the first stage with the lullaby, followed by the siren, and shortly afterwards, the text message will be sent to my phone. Notify me that I left my kid in the car. There it is now. I'll be able to respond with a number of options. One of them being calling the police or deactivating the alarm. By sending triple zero. I'll be able to contact the police for this demonstration. A blue and red flashing light will represent the police. Receive the message. Now by sending one to the device, the device will be deactivated. The device has not been deactivated.